Well, four years after a nurse's strike that hit early in the pandemic, the union representing the strikers is being ordered to pay a Riverside Hospital $6.2 million. An arbiter says the union didn't follow contract rules when they walked out. KCAL News reporter Nicole Comstock is in Riverside with details. It was a 10 day strike over apparent staffing shortages and personal protective equipment three months into the coronavirus pandemic when hospitals were slammed with severely sick patients. And now four years later, a federal arbitrator ordered that nurses union to pay $6.26 million in damages to Riverside Community Hospital, calling that strike unlawful. So that's ridiculous. Uh, I'm a union member, so I don't think that's right. They should not get fined for something like that. Some community members are disappointed in this development since healthcare workers across the country were initially hailed as heroes. They have to deal with the risk of like getting COVID themselves because they have to be there. They obviously have families and stuff. The ruling found that the strike violated the union's collective bargaining agreement and the money is meant to cover the cost of replacing those workers who walked out during the clash over safety. And we are pleading, please staff us safely. We believe that we meet all of the requests. Months after the strike, the hospital was still so strapped for staff, the National Guard sent in a team to help. But the hospital maintained it was a nationwide issue. HCA Healthcare tells us our contract was clear and the union showed reckless disregard for its members and the Riverside community by calling the strike. We applaud the arbitrator's decision. I know they have to work because they're in healthcare and stuff like that, but you can't overwork them. The labor union SEIU 121RN said about the ruling in part, healthcare workers made enormous sacrifices to keep their community safe during the pandemic, including overcoming their fears of retaliation for telling the truth about what was happening in the hospital walls to penalize them for doing so is an affront to the free speech rights of all workers. The union says it plans on appealing this ruling in Riverside. I'm Nicole Comstock, KCAL News.